Hello. Happy New Year's, Arius. Happy New Year's. Love and light, babies. Love and light. I hope you guys are coming into the New Year's feeling inspired. Ready to take action. Ready to move forward. And always, always, always keeping your good intentions, baby. <clears throat> Spirit, ancestors, angel guides, you are welcome into the room for a general areas read. To my subscribers, welcome back, baby. To those of you who are new to my channel, I am Lee. I will be bringing you the tea, babe. It gets a little raw and reckless up in here sometimes. But my intention is never to hurt your feelings. So take what's for you, what's not for you. You need it for Cinderella, baby. Don't apply pressure. Don't apply pressure. Please be kind. Please subscribe. It's free. If any of this video resonates with you, please hit that like button. If you would like to send me a little comment. Talk to me nice, baby. I read those. Okay, honeys. We will be starting with the Moonology Oracles for 2024. For areas, spirit ancestors, angel guides, what messages do you have for our areas today? Here we go, babies. Here we go. Messages for areas. What do they need to know? What do they need to hear to take along with them on this soul's journey? For our area, spirit ancestors, angel guides, clear, concise messages for areas. Expect powerful change, baby. Ooh, a time to give rather than take. Powerful change, baby. Let's see if I can find it quickly. These they don't have numbers. They just. Um, new moon, new moon, new moon, eclipse, New moon, baby. If you want affirmations that you can achieve your dreams and get the desired outcome in situations you're asking about, then this is it, baby. This is it, baby. This is a card of beginnings and there are powerful energies at work. But be prepared. It could be quite a ride and events now could even be jarring and uncomfortable. However, any new direction you take will almost always lead somewhere better than where you are at the moment. Whatever is happening now is happening for a reason. You'll appreciate later on. A new portal is opening up and all you have to do is have the courage to forget about the past and move through it. You're being put back on the right path. There is nothing to fear, baby. Yes. So never mind the past, baby. Never mind the past. It's a new day. It's a new dawn, baby. Okay? It's a new day. It's a new dawn. A time to take a time to give rather than take. Okay? So be open. Be open to giving. Be open to um to change. Be open to 2024, baby. Be open to 2024. Make it do what it do, Arius. Make it do what it do. Let go and let go. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Moving on. Messages from the mermaids. From our areas. <clears throat> Healing, baby. Healing. 
Yes. Yielding, baby. I like that. And on the bottom, you have positivity. So stay positive. Stay focused. Let's go. It's time to move forward. It's time to move forward. No more looking back. No more looking back. Healing. These mermaids bring a powerful healing energy into your reading today. This healing can be for your mind, body, or spirit, or for all three. If you don't need healing at this time, then it's for, then it's for someone close to you or the recipient of the read. Parts of the healing process is to believe you deserve to be healed and to also be receptive on a subconscious level to healing energies. Now this might sur now this might sound strange, but feeling and truly believing that you're worthy of being healed is a huge part of becoming whole again and free from this disease. <clears throat> um, have you considered a path in the healing arts? There are so many ways to administer healing. Simply listening can greatly help someone to feel heard which in turn can lead to an inner healing and transformation. Are you being called to heal another? Okay, so for some of you, you may be a healer, okay? You may be a messenger. You may, uh, you may be someone who's good at listening to others or to um, problem solving for someone. Um, if that is the case, then you are being asked to do just that. Okay, babies? To do just that. <clears throat> or, if it's yourself, to let go of the past and to look forward to the future, to um, to accept change, okay? To forgive yourself and others. Okay, babies? It ain't an easy situation. Things ain't just gonna go flowy, flowy. Because change is uh, rarely easy. So we're moving on into the tarot for our areas. Hit the deck, baby. Yes. Yes. Manifest the life that you deserve. The life that you want, baby. Create some magic areas. Create some magic. Okay. Um, you are powerful enough to make changes in your life. You have the tools necessary um, to balance your life out. Um, the strength to put in the work. Okay. To put something in motion. The past. The past, the past is creeping up on you, baby. You may be wanting to return to someone, something from the past. Uh, someone from the past may be wanting to return, baby, to you, baby. Okay, a time when uh, you felt loved, a time where you felt safe. It can be you, it can be them. Okay, uh, we have a king of wands. Feels like somebody's reminiscing. Okay, someone's reminiscing on a time where they felt safe, a time where they were secure. Um, someone may be trying to bring this back to the light, or you may be, um, you may have stepped away from the situation in order to um, find yourself. Stepping away to find yourself, to create your own magic, to uh, page of pentacles in reverse. Okay, so you may be on a long ranger journey on your own right now. And you may be looking back at a time where you felt safe, you were secure. Uh, you were stable. Uh, you may have removed yourself 
<clears throat> in order to find yourself or you was looking for a part of yourself that some there was lack somewhere but it was personal personal lack okay personal lack You may have walked away for the wrong reasons. You may have walked away uh, or removed yourself. Not as I, I don't see walking away, but I see removing yourself. With the hermit um, is um, self-reflection, right? The hermit is um, solitude, soul searching, retreating. Okay, so you may have removed yourself from a situation trying to find yourself, soul searching. You may have felt like there was something missing in your life. So you <clears throat> checking out your options, seeing what's what, what's what, baby, what's what. <sighs> um, so it feels like someone got distracted. Someone got distracted or led astray from a stable foundation or something that they was building on. Or uh, you may have been building a family, building a home, um, creating a life for yourself with others. And deciding to remove yourself because something was missing. Something was missing or something distracted you. We got the Page of Pentacles in reverse. We got the Seven of Cups in reverse. And now we got the Moon in reverse. Okay, so... Um, somebody ain't seeing things clearly. Okay, or somebody's being resistant. And we got the Hangman on the bottom. So it makes me feel like somebody's waiting. Someone is not sure. Someone is waiting. Okay, so someone is waiting for the right person. So someone is waiting for the right person. Okay, so you may have someone specific in mind. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I love it. I love it. Look at this. Four Wands, the lovers, and uh, victory being noticed. Um, okay, somebody's waiting for the right person, maybe for the right time, in order to offer stability. Ooh, ooh, honesty, victory, healing, want to collaborate, want to work together, want to <clears throat> remove the bondage and move forward. Okay, and then we had the king of wands down there, and the next one up is the queen, the queen of wands right here. So someone is waiting for their soulmate. Okay, someone, but there may be interference or distractions. Uh, this may be someone you already, you not talking. There's no communication. This is someone who's on your mind heavy. This is someone who you already know, someone you've been with already, someone you already been intimate with. Um, your soulmate, your soulmate, baby. So it makes me feel like in the midst of soul searching, in the midst of la la land, distractions, the internet, uh, dating, um, searching for what it is that you want in your life, you may have been coming to the conclusion that you already met your soulmate. 
and that you're going to um, hold off for that person. Okay. It seems like someone is taking a moment. They're taking a moment because they want their person. They don't want any old body. I don't want any old cup. <laughs> okay. Somebody want their cup. Somebody want their soulmate. Someone wants to be successful. Okay. Someone wants to be noticed. Someone wants to be appreciated. Or someone wants to show someone appreciation for having them in their life. This is uh, someone or something that you are manifesting in your life. Something you've prayed for. Um, we have one, two, three, four. Four major arcanas here. So this is something that you feel strongly about. Okay, babies something you feel strongly about baby spirit ancestors angel guys please don't forget to subscribe areas let's help each other help each other okay we've been growing our little tribe i appreciate you guys i appreciate your love and support to my channel thank you all so much so go ahead and hit that little subscribe button it's free to you baby hit that notification bell so that you can be notified somebody's holding back Somebody staying in a bubble, baby. Somebody really holding out for someone. Okay, specific. This is very specific. There's a specific person. A specific person that you already know, that you already been with, that you love. Okay, um, that person may be in a relationship with another person, and that may be the holdup, but... As far as you're concerned, that's your person. That's your person, baby. And you're uninterested in anyone else. Hold them back. Uninterested. Okay, uninterested because why? Because you miss somebody. You missing somebody, baby. Nostalgia. Somebody that felt like home. Somebody that felt warm. Somebody that uh, made you feel safe. Someone that you... Your person. <laughs> okay, someone that you feel like is your person. Yep. Okay, so for some of you, you may need some advice. Okay, talk to someone. Someone wise. Someone who may have good intentions towards you. Okay, um, this may be, okay, this may be two different people. One is holding back. The other one is uninterested. Makes sense. Ace of Cups. On top of the Hermit. Pulling back, waiting for the one, the one. Ace of Cups. The one. Okay, baby. The one. Say, I don't want all that, all that, all that shit out there. All the options. <laughs> I don't want the options. I want the one. King of Wands came out again. Uh, King of Wands, Fire Sign, Leo, Leo, Sag, Arius. Uh, the Moon, uh, Pisces. Gemini. Gemini. Um, we got Virgo out here. We got Taurus out here. We got uh, Sagittarius, Leo, Arius. All right, that's what we got. That's what we got so far, so far. All right, so we have the King of Wands. The King of Wands is passionate. Uh, he's in the center of the reading. Someone is healed. Someone has healed. Someone is healing. 
Okay, it came up up top. Someone needs to heal. Okay, in the reverse, we got the three of, three of swords in the reverse. So, the king of wands is passionate. Uh, the King of Wands is passionate, uh, unafraid, uh, adventurous. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh. So somebody trying to move fast. The Chariot, forward movement, baby. Before somebody takes off, before somebody, before they completely lose someone. So someone may be trying to come forward after a healing process, after soul searching, after um, checking out their options and realizing that ain't nothing out there that they want. Um, coming back in. Clarity. Okay, now they have clarity. Now they're sure. Now, that, now they're sure. Or now you're sure. It can be you. It can be them. Okay. Sure. Coming back. Before someone walks away. Okay. Putting down the burdens. Um, maybe carrying a lot of responsibilities. Seeing someone carrying a lot of responsibility. Uh, that just made me feel like somebody is trying to help someone with the responsibility. With the baggage. Somebody trying to come in to add to a situation. Okay, okay. Nice, nice. Can we get one more for our areas? One more for our areas. Spirit ancestors, angel guides, and the sun. On top of the lovers. Ooh, ooh. So, areas. It may be time to get that advice. Okay. Thing with advice is you take, you listen to what they got to say, you remember what you've been through, you also apply your own experiences, your own knowledge, how you feel, okay? You follow your intuition, you mesh it all up together in order to come up with an outcome, right? Okay, so um, as you do that and you go through a healing uh, phase and you understand that everything that's shining gold um that there ain't nothing really out there for you okay you're tired of feeling left out in the cold or lack of then either it could be you it can be them deciding to come back in to lighten the load coming back in to lighten the load Okay, the uh, the six of wands is home, is family, is ceremony, is togetherness, right? It's a soulmate connection, baby. Okay, that's gonna make you happy with the one you love. Okay, babe, with the one you love, baby, with the one you love. So, let's move into the Romance Angels for our areas. Don't forget to subscribe, areas. Thank you all so much. I appreciate you guys for helping to grow my little tribe. Here we go, here we go. Lovers Oracles for areas. What do they need to know? Clear messages for our areas. Spirit Ancestors Angel Guides. Clear messages for our areas. Playfulness, baby. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to a fun to shine. So be lighthearted. Okay? Be lighthearted. Be, be uh, playful. Uh, a little jokey jokey. A little play play, you know. Break the ice, baby. Break the ice, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Retreat. Only this time with your person. Down there, the hermit retreats by himself. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. All right? It's time to disconnect from the world. People, places, and things don't need to go, baby. Okay? Just you and your person.
Okay, so may need a room for two. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. And past life relationship. You have known each other before. <laughs> confirmation, baby. Confirmation. Ooh. Confirmation for our areas. See what we get over here, baby. The love. Oracle. For areas. So, yes. Spending some time with your person. Uh, reaching out to the person. Letting them know how you feel. Maybe, um, you know, y'all can heal together. Okay. What can it do what it do, baby? Reconciliation. Yes. Reunion. Second chance. Back together. I miss you. Ha <laughs> ha. There you go, Arius. There you go. Making moves. Making moves in the new year. Making moves, baby. Make it do what it do. Always, always with good intention, baby. Secret crush. Admire. Attraction. Suitor. Butterflies. Liquid courage. Bravery. Confidence. Intoxicating eye behavior. Okay, so somebody might get a couple shots in them and become brave. <laughs> so somebody might be sending out a drunk text or popping up. Yeah. Healing, wounds, improving, mending, progress. Again, healing. So this situation needed healing, okay? You may need it to heal. They may need to heal. Y'all may have needed time apart in order to understand what was best for you, what you really want in your life, who you really want in your life, okay? Because um, sometimes you don't know what you got till you lose it, baby. Okie dokie. Okay, okay. So let's get some messages. Lovey dovey. Lovey dovey. Let's see if they have some sweet stuff to say to you, baby. What would it be, baby? What would it be? What do they have? What is the message for Aries from their person? If they could tell them anything, what would it be? Here we go, baby. Here we go. It says difficulty. Jealousies from others may serve as obstacles to the success of this connection. Can't be listening to other people. Okay, a relationship is two people. I understand that sometimes you need some advice, you know, sometimes you don't have all the answers. Okay? But that doesn't mean that everybody has good intentions towards you, that everybody wants you to be happy, that everybody's going to give you good advice, okay? Some people, misery, love company. Here we go, here we go. Can we get two more for our Aries? Two more, three more. Put yourself first. Loving yourself makes, your, makes you more romantically attractive. Respect yourself. Respect your body. Okay? Stay optimistic. Positive thinking and faith will bring romance into your life. Be honest with yourself and with others, baby. Keep the door open. Don't be so focused on a closed door that you don't see the ones which open for you. Okay? You may think that the door is closed. You might have to knock. Hello? <laughs> we got spinning the block with the chariot, right? engagement your love life is soon ascending to a higher level of commitment Woo, for our areas let me give you a fortune cookie baby fortune cookie for our areas Woo, stay optimistic baby stay optimistic work on your healing um expect powerful changes baby Okay, expect powerful changes. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Fortune cookie. Surprise. A disappointment will be followed by a pleasant surprise. An invitation could bring love to those searching. Yes, yes, yes. And on the bottom you have friendships in your life may come to an end. 
Others could blossom and become stronger. Reflections, baby. Okay? And that was your tea, baby. Smooches.